A priceless relic that's seen as one of the finest examples of metalwork from the unified Chilla period is unveiled. With ultra-thin engraving and exquisite detail, the gold leaf artifact left experts speechless. Kim bo Young shares with us the details. Unbelievable. This can't be something that's man-made. The words of experts after seeing a gold leaf artifact unearthed from South Korea's Dongguk Palace and Walji Pond in November 2016. Gyeongju National Research Institute of Cultural Heritage finally unveiled this sophisticated, outstanding gilt relic from the 8th century on Thursday. The artifact was initially discovered as two separate pieces situated approximately 20 meters apart from one another. But after going through a conservation process, it was found to have been one single artifact. Bird and flower patterns are intricately engraved on the thinly spread out gold that measures 3.6 centimeters by 1.17 centimeters. The jaw dropping patterns are carved at a thickness of 0.05 millimeters. That's finer than a human hair and even difficult to see with the naked eye. Experts all agree that this artifact displays the essence of 8th century unified Chilla period metalwork. Delicately having all the elements one would want with flawless technology, it is not an exaggeration to say this is a global level craft work. Experts say gold leaf engraved with these patterns also reveals Western influences, but ones which have been transformed in Chilla's own unique way. We can see the outstanding craftsmanship of Silla artisans from that time, showing the pinnacle of metalwork technology and the culture of that time. I hope this artifact can trigger more research on Silla period metal craft work. This outstanding relic will be on display for the public at the Gyeongju National Research Institute of Cultural Heritage until October 31st through an exhibition titled The Blooming Flowers and Birds on 3-centimeter Gold Leaf. Kim Bo-kyung, Arirang News.